Hobby Lobby had so much, so, so, so much. Like, I can't believe how much they had, but I was a little overwhelmed. They had too much. No, I can't ever say they had too much. All right, y'all, welcome back to my channel. I'm Monica, and if you are new here, I like to make motherhood and lifestyle videos. I make a lot of cleaning and organizing videos as well because I really enjoy doing that. And hey, most of motherhood, I think, is cleaning and cooking and taking care of your children. So that's mostly what I've shown you guys, but I'm going to dip my toe more into decorating and hauls because I think that is so much fun to watch. But anyways, I wanted to show you the fall things that I bought this year. You guys, today's video is extra special because it is a collab with Marissa from That's So Davis. Marissa is a mother of three, all five and under, just like me, and I really enjoy her channel. She makes motherhood cleaning and lifestyle videos, kind of like me as well. So <laughs> she has a bunch of routines out right now, which I have loved watching. She has a bunch of vlogs which are always so fun to watch other people's day in the lives. And then she has a bunch of cleaning videos just like me too. So if you enjoy my channel, then you're gonna love her channel. I went to a few different stores and then I was able to pull out a few things that I found from the previous years. Let me go over the previous years first and then I'll show you what I got this year. And this is not gonna be a full on in your face fall haul or yeah, just not a full on fall through up in my house because one, I usually don't decorate too much for fall. I'm more of like, let me go all out for Halloween because I have children and because that's more fun. And two, I want to transition from summer into from summer till fall. So I'm gonna do not everything super orange, not everything fall through up, basically. I'm gonna do little colors that I think could be transitioning from summer to fall. And it's gonna be quite a minimal look because I am finding out that the older I get, the less I want. But decorating has always interested me, so let's decorate. Let me go over what I've had in my little Tupperwares, and it's not very much, but it's at least something to start with. So I found these in my Tupperware. They are just wired ribbon, and they're really thick. So obviously I did not use them any of the other years that I have them. So maybe this year I'll actually make a wreath out of them and hang it either on my pantry door or on my front door, just depending on where I think it'll look best. So I have five ribbons. There are these little glitter pumpkins that I got from Target last year on clearance. I am going to use them this year. I'll probably use a few colors for my transition. And then once we get farther into fall, I'll probably do another haul with a decorating claim with me as well and adding these into what I'm gonna put out already. So those pumpkins with these ribbons. Then I have these little pumpkins that I got quite a while ago. These are more for Thanksgiving just because of the words that are on them. They say, count your blessings, give thanks to the Lord, and be thankful. I'm gonna use these for Thanksgiving, so I'm not gonna put them out quite yet. Or for fall, fall, I'll probably put them out in November or the end of October for Thanksgiving. And we're probably not gonna do like a big old Thanksgiving either, but decorating will be fun and we can do something with the girls with them. These say welcome and they're just little candle holders. So I might use these now. I might use these for Thanksgiving or when I add on to my fall, full on fall decorating. And then this is very fall. It says pumpkin spice and everything nice and it has some pumpkins. This is from last year Hobby Lobby. No, 
This is from La this is from last year Michaels, and I'm sure they have plenty more like that this year. I know I saw a bunch at Hobby Lobby. This one says, "But I think I love fall most of all," and this is so true. Like I just love fall. It kicks start. It kickstarts all the holidays. What I feel like once it hits August, the year is over. Cause then it's like back to school, fall everything, pumpkin everything. We should just call it pumpkin season or pumpkin spice season until it's actually Christmas. Because I don't know, fall's the best. So let me put these here and I'll show you all of the new stuff that I got. And hopefully you guys can find these at your local stores as well if you like these items or these colors. All right, like I said, these items are just to kickstart my fall decorating and to kickstart the fall season. It's not a lot. I stayed within my budget and I only went to three stores because mom life got a hold of me and I kind of literally went with only three stores were open. I missed out on Michaels, Home Goods, I missed out on Lloyd Ross, Kirkland, Joanne, all the good stores closed super early here. So I was only able to go to Hobby Lobby, Big Lots, and Target. And none of them had a whole lot other than Hobby Lobby and it just wasn't vibing with me. So I only got a few things that I thought would be nice transitions from summer to fall. So let me show you what I've got. I don't get anything done, you stuck on my mind. I keep on missing your touch, missing your vibe. This is not a lot at all by any means, but it's what I found, what I liked. It was not very expensive at all, and this is a good start to any fall collection or any fall haul. Yeah, that's a good word. Anyways. Let me show you what I got. I went to Target and they have nothing in their dollar section. They have nothing throughout their home areas really. So I just was looking to see what they had and they didn't have anything. So I only got this tray that I can use to decorate for every season because it's so neutral and I'm loving all of that natural wood and more simplistic decorating as well and it's really good quality it's this nice wooden tray it's by hearth and hand and it's called a charger tray everything that I'm able to link for you guys I totally will because I think these are good staples like this is a really good staple for all the holidays you can decorate it like you would a tiered tray but I just found the tier trays to be so expensive and such and not great quality right now. So until I can find one that I really like that isn't an arm or a leg, <laughs> I will purchase that. But for now, this will be great on a counter. It'll be great on a little sofa table. You can put it on, you can put it on your island. You can put it on an entryway table. It just adds great, what's the word? Like dimension or, it's just great. Anyways, this was from Target and it's by Hearth and Hand Magnolia. And I can't wait to decorate this with a bunch of pumpkins. I went to Big Lots and saw mm, maybe an aisle or two of fall stuff. And a lot of the colors were super orangey and I'm not ready for full on orange because I think full on orange is Halloween, which I cannot wait to decorate for. And I wanted to go with whites and natural colors. I picked a few different green things. So this is what I got from Big Lots. And this says sweater weather, which I think is a great fall item. It doesn't say anything about pumpkins. It doesn't say anything about fall, but it says sweater weather, which I love. Who else loves sweater weather? Then I got this candle that says pumpkin spice and this is from Big Lots as well. I don't know if I'll actually burn it. I might burn it. Um, it's a nice, 
spicy smell. It's not really like pumpkin spice, but it'll look great as decoration and not, not necessarily like practical. It's just great decoration. I don't really have to use it if I don't like the smell of it or anything. I love that it's white in a little jar and that it goes with the colors that I picked out. And then I got the most from Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby had so much, so, so, so much. Like, I can't believe how much they had, but I was a little overwhelmed. They had too much. No, I can't ever say they had too much. Hobby Lobby had a lot of good stuff. They had a lot of different color schemes. They had a lot of that black and white check. They had orange, orange galore a lot of muted colors. I even saw some pink there and a lot of harvesty things, but I wanted to do some minimal shopping. So this is what I got. These pumpkins and succulents I think are going to be beautiful. I can't wait to put some of them on here. I plan on decorating some of our picture ledges with them. So just little pops of that green and the orange and the white or that cream color. A little bit of the succulents I think are going to be really pretty throughout my home. And then I got two of these bigger green pumpkins as well to throw in there with that transition. And then I got a few little signs just to put just everywhere throughout where I'm going to decorate. This one says morning pumpkin and it's like a little coffee cup. It's really cute. This one says pumpkin spice everything. Love it. This would be, these two would be so cute on a bar cart, which I'm still looking for. If you guys have any bar cart ideas, leave them down below for me. I might put these in my little coffee area. I might just scatter them throughout because Tanner and I are big, I know I shouldn't say this, but Tanner and I are big, basic pumpkin spice everything. You got pumpkin in it, we're gonna eat it. We're gonna at least try it. So stay tuned because I'm gonna do some fall recipes with a few of my girlfriends here on YouTube and you guys are gonna love it because I'm sure we're gonna do some pumpkin stuff for you guys. Then I have this one that's green and it just says, hello fall. And it's a little pumpkin, which is really cute. And then this one is just so cute. It actually made me think of the clean nest. I love her. She is, she got me into saying friends. And I don't know why I never really use that term like, hey friend, like welcome friend or anything like that because it just makes you smile. So Nikki actually got me into saying, Hello friends, welcome friends, welcome back friends. And this made me think of her. It just says, welcome friends. And I can use this all year round. It doesn't have to be fall, but I think it's perfect. It actually came with a little string that you can hang, but I'll probably just put it standing up like this somewhere. Ah, you guys, I never ended this and I'm editing it and have to end it somehow. So thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you all. And guys, I am past 100 subscribers and that makes me so excited. So I'm going to do a little tiny video sometime this week to explain the giveaway and for you all to watch. So don't forget to turn on that bell notification so that you're notified when I upload that giveaway video. Anyway, I wanted to say thank you so much for joining me in my fall haul. I hope you guys go out there and you get some fall transitions as well and then let me know what your color scheme is for this year. If you are coming from Marissa's channel, thank you so much for watching. I am so excited that you're here. Please don't forget to hit that red subscribe button so that you can stick around and I will see you guys all in my next video. Bye!